Hey guys, it's Rob again over here at Marina Point, checking on the uh, advancements. They topped off last month, so I wanted to get down here, show you that, talk to Marika, which we're gonna head there in a minute in the sales center. Uh, but I also wanted to show you, they have Cresellers is now open, Duckweed is open, we got drink, uh, coffee and tea coming soon, Quench Juice Bar, and many more businesses, steps away from your future residence here at Marina Point. So here we're looking at uh, on this side. Sorry, hold on. Let me go through the cascades. That's what we're looking at here. Right, the center one where the hoist lift is going right now. Yes. They're actually going up. That's where the ballard is, and that's where the entrance is to the lobby. Okay, so you're coming from here. It's coming in here. Right, yeah. you're coming in here, and then you drive along the building. You go into the garage right over here. That's the amenity deck. We're looking right now. We're looking at those harbor homes. Yep. And I only have one left. That one is um, two million zero four nine. And for a limited time. For a limited time yes. only. <laughs> right, exactly. I mean, they're a unique concept because they're four stories high. Every level has its own private balcony. It does have a elevator that takes you up to your fourth floor. That's your entertainment area because that has a spiral staircase that goes directly up to the um, amenity deck. Okay. So you have your gated, you know, you go take a dip in the pool quick and boom, you're right out downstairs and continue entertaining. Awesome. It's like a banner room. Yeah. Yes. So and, that, and that price will probably be going up, right? Yeah. At For some the point. next seven homes, I mean, the next seven homes will start around 2.2, 2.3. Yeah. I know. They're so. unusual. So, but the other price point, I mean, you can still buy in the Cascade for a little over a million and it's on the second floor on the seventh floor you're like looking at 1.309 i only have the 12th floor left which is a little around the 1.6 mm -hmm. so um the cascade open is a two bedroom that's the one sticking out towards your left and those are we removed the third bedroom and made it a breakfast nook so we opened this whole area up which is quite amazing and then the balconies of course they all have the privacy uh, wall in between the two residences and those are 40 feet in length and 8 feet wide so you got and this is the bigger one 47 feet 47 feet so you have a little bit of water view from your balcony on the Aspire which is a two bedroom and then if you look at the Dauphin reverse that I only have on the 14th 15th and 16th and I mean and you literally I mean it is a 180 degree view you got sun sunrise here and sunsets from the St. Pete area because St. Pete is right and then the here. lagoon is here the lagoon is right here correct right yeah mm -hmm. following along yeah because so. I mean this is where the amenity deck would be and then this is where your second tower would be another amenity deck and then the third tower mm -hmm. so how many slips good. it's gonna be like a hundred There's slips going to be or 149 for us and the five years and then there will be Oh, go right up there. to the restaurant. Nice. No start at a hundred. They start at uh, close to ninety-nine. Ninety-nine. Call it a hundred. <laughs> Forty footer. Yeah, and we can accommodate up to one hundred and fifteen, um, and the depth is close to twelve feet right here in the marina itself because it was all industrial so they had barges coming in right so it was like a whole different so you can accommodate up to a hundred foot boat 115 115 At foot the boat end of the pier. i have two two sections where i can accommodate 115 foot yacht and that would be at the same ninety-nine thousand, or no, that higher. That's yeah, starting. Uh -huh. You would okay. be looking around the um, all you can, you, because we can put your can combine too. Right. Okay, so two of them will okay. be approximately so in, close to two hundred thousand. Close to yeah, something you know you might actually end at two seventy-five really, because you have the end piers like 
144 and one. Well, yeah, you're you're looking around at 275. 275. If you own a 115 foot yacht, 275 is a deal. Yeah. But yeah, just <clears throat> looking at the building from this angle, we're looking back at those cascades again. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we've turned around. So oh, okay. the entire. Yeah. So we're at the cascades. Right. Is what we're looking at mm -hmm. right here. Right there. Yep. So those are the cascades. Straight up. Okay, straight up. Um, we're putting the windows in right now, the sliders, everything is being put in. What you're seeing on top of the glass is kind of like a plexi dip. So we coat it on there and then at the end, you know, when the building is finished, it's all painted and so forth, we just Peels peel it off. right off. Okay. So it's, it's just to... Are they tinted at all? Underneath? Yeah, see how okay. the um, okay this the second the third floor on the corner doesn't have any coating on it. Am I all over here? See how it's yeah. reflective? Yeah. It's a reflective. It's like yeah. Well, I'm not wearing my uh, so. reflective glasses, but um, it's about an inch thick. It's got inch gas. Thick? It's, yeah, it's an inch thick. It has oh. gas in between the glass. Oh, okay. It's got a heat double pane efficient and a um, cooling energy sufficient there's your cascade so if you look at the building you see the pillar on the there's no pillar here they mm -hmm. forgot to put that in there but the pillar going all the way up because the building flares out so the higher up you go you gain square footage within within the unit itself well that would be on this corner here yes. uh -huh. right the these north. guys are standing on the balcony over here and they're overlooking the entire Tampa area but yeah, so now we're looking at the air hearts. Those are the two big guys, okay? The ones the four bedrooms coming mm -hmm. this direction and to your right, that's the Dauphin Reverse. Right. Okay, so those are three bedroom ones and those are, you know, anywhere around the 1.5, 1.6, under 1450, under 164. So the four bedrooms, so, which are these air hearts, yeah. are 3,042 square foot mm -hmm. or 3,168. Right. Four and that's just an average taken from the ninth floor because the building again as you can see flares out so you gain the square footage on the exterior units mm -hmm. except for the two interior ones but yeah we're looking at the garage which is the four-story garage and we're looking at some of the storage units to your right and on the left of the garage that's already the second part of the second tower that has that stairwell oh, sorry I see oh, elevator. okay i see now better it, over uh -huh. here yeah. right elevator so and that whole entire boulder wall that's going to have greenery coming through it so it's going to look like a natural habitat so fish and you know it promotes the green greenery right. in the area and um, so fishing will be great you'll catch a fresh grouper right there will yeah. that stone yeah, facade the stay wall, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's what we we're just finishing up where the crane is Mm -hmm. Okay, so we we started, you know, about two months in in the front over there, and these huge boulders are being brought in, and instead of doing in a brand new seawall like that, we wanted to make it look a little more appealing with some greenery. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. You want... But this is great. This is great for paddle boarding and kayaking, just around, you know. Oh yeah, especially if you have a. Area. Yeah. Some kids or whatever. But again, you know, you can do this walkway all the way along the entire building back to the promenade where we just came from for like, it's a mile and a half. So it's three miles. So you're doing like a three mile walk. There's always going to be something to do. Never. There is always something to do in Western yeah. Marina District. That's for sure. Yes. And in the area. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, guys. So uh, thank you. And if you want more information, obviously, you can visit my site. Again. Yeah. <laughs> Call me and let me make the introduction and we'll take it from there.